With the Winter Olympics and some of the last medals of the games being handed out on this final weekend of the events, ABC's Maggie Rooley joins us from Beijing with more. Maggie, good morning. Hey, Rick, good morning. Yeah, the games here might be winding down, but Team USA, they're fighting until the very end, adding more medals to the leaderboard. Overnight, Team USA snagging two spots on the podium in men's free ski half pipe, fighting brutally cold conditions and high winds that commentators were calling a tube of terror. David Wise out to defend his golds in the last two Olympics, landing back to back double cork 1260s and defying gravity to nab silver. And 27-year-old Alex Ferreira laying down four double corks to secure the bronze, his second Olympic medal after getting silver in 2018. Over in the rink, Team USA's Timothy LaDuke making history the moment they hit the ice. The 31-year-old's the first ever openly non-binary Winter Olympian. Dazzling the crowd in Friday's pair skate with Ashley Kane Gribble, the pair sits in seventh place right behind Team USA's Alexa Kiram and Brandon Frazier. And another medal for Alana Myers-Taylor, picking up a bronze in the two women bobsled after already grabbing a silver in the monobob earlier this week. We caught up with the now five-time medalist just after her monobob win. How does it feel to have that medal around your neck? I still don't really believe it happened. Alana tested positive for COVID after she got to the Olympics and was forced to quarantine for a week. It was a complete emotional roller coaster, trying to stay positive in isolation and trying to continually tell myself that we still have a shot. But she always stayed positive, focusing on getting to this moment, hands raised, crossing the finish line in victory. It's like screaming and yelling and crying. And it was just so overwhelming and amazing. Guys, I loved watching that moment. Well, Alana was supposed to be a flag bearer in the opening ceremony, but then she got COVID, had to give up her spot. But some good news, Alana just found out she was chosen to be the flag bearer in the closing ceremony for Team USA. I love this, guys. Just a full circle Olympic moment. Eva? We will all be watching her carrying that flag. Maggie, really for us there. Thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.